Gentlemen, welcome back to Global News Podcast. And today we're gonna go over what something that I call electro universe. Okay? Electro universe. What does this mean? Well, electro universe is a concept in which we will be living in, okay, as it relates to how we are living it now and where we're going based off of all the conditions, all the changes, all of the concepts of technology and moving forward, okay? Now, there's movies that are out there that you may have seen that kind of depict some of this, okay? And if you are quite familiar with one of the movies are called Demolition Man with Sylvester Stallone and Wesley Snipes. Now, that just gave us an introduction to electrical cars. If you remember that movie, things were, people were like, hey, is that true? Can a car really drive itself? Well, we have them now, autopilot vehicles, where in which they are electrical and you tell it where to go and it will take you there, okay? That is one sign or concept of this now right now there is a war going on that is causing the gas prices to increase and go up right so as a solution when you're running a country and you have to make sure that everything the economy is still uh circulating and it is constantly growing and uh, helping bring in revenue and earnings so that there's no depressions or recessions in the country in which you live. Now, if a abrupt change in any of that can cause one of those two things. Now, as a leader of a country, you do not want this to happen. So at this point, we know that there's high inflation and there's a gas crisis that are occurring right now okay in the united states there is a reserve amount of gas that is saved for times like this and at the end of the day we know that eventually gas is going to be obsolete now, how do we know this? Because you can look around and we already are starting with the electrical vehicles. As I mentioned before, like in Demolition Man. Now, what will be the next thing? Well, electricity has always been around. It is a natural energy that is used to supply our homes, lighting, roadways, different things. That you can eat that you wouldn't even see you can run a whole house off of electric okay for heating cooling so on and so forth now also electricity is re reusable now with that being said okay if we have gases that pollutes the air as well as used to operate vehicles and things like that and then gas becomes a problem and then we automatically shift away from using gas as a source of energy, just like coal was used, gas, fossil fuels, so on, etc. Electricity is not going anywhere because it's made naturally, okay, by the energy from the sun, and water can generate electricity. And with that being said, okay, so you have many. Uh, different scientists and people who study technology they combine the two to come up with solutions to change in which whenever there's a shift in a lack of resource or minerals then there must be some solution to this and at this point electricity is definitely that okay don't be surprised there's other movies that depict this where everything is gonna be ran off of electricity, including weapons, guns, vehicles, your homes. Uh, you have uh, technology like uh, these new uh, bots that you see 
uh, Sophia, and uh, there's a whole list of other ones uh, that can be used around the house, um, so on and so forth. This is all off electricity, and we will come go from the less cleaner ages and stages in which we're in now, and then shift to this what I call electro universe. And then the concept continues to personal planes, cars that fly, so on and so forth. This is where we are headed. If cooler heads prevail and there's no destructions uh, with possibly nuclear weapons. Okay. Now, another point I wanted to mention. Okay. They are already doing it in Detroit. And it is installing electro and they're also doing it overseas uh, they're installing electro charging roads what does this mean well if you have an electrical vehicle and some of you know that um, when you're maintaining and maintenancing a electrical vehicle you have to take it to your home and then you have to charge it at home plug it up and then uh, it'll last for however many hours or so while you're or miles while you're on the road before you need to pull over and recharge Okay, well the problem with that is There's not a lot of charging ports. Let's say you want to go across the country It would be challenging to be able to make it to certain destinations because you have to go way out of your travel itinerary just to go recharge your vehicle and then get back on the road, which can be inconvenient. So in the city of Detroit, they have already began, I believe starting in downtown somewhere, installing these electro charging roads that allows your vehicle or whatever is um, electrical charged or EV, it can ride down these roads as well as being charged along the way so they never have to pull over or better yet go to find some charging uh, station that is far away from your home to rejuvenate your uh, vehicles. Now, I think this is uh, really the starting point to, as I mentioned, okay, we are going into a electro universe and it's happening right underneath your eyes and these products are being tried, tested and then put out into us as consumers but the concept is eventually going to be dependent on electricity so um, here you have it here first on global news where we did the research on this and uh, if you just pay attention and start looking into these different concepts and of course the company Tesla is going to be at the forefront of this. There's other things that have happened. There's been, I believe, uh, incentives for these other automakers to uh, also produce electric fuel efficient electro producing technology in their vehicles, so on and so forth. You're going to have boats. <laughs> You're going to have, I mean, anything and everything that is made mechanically is going to be using electrical energy to move it along. So this is, you heard it first on Global News, my take on where we're headed as far as technology and science into this new electro universe. And once again, if you like this video, share it uh, because you need to know what's going on and how it helps and improve our lives and others and um, how we go from you know the wheel the wooden wheel into the electrical flying vehicles now so thank you once again if you like this video share it and do not forget to subscribe if you haven't already thank you and have a great day